this is this is f***ing trading. channel still going through the Street Fighter 30th anniversary collection I've got two left and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this one because I tried it earlier and it's impossible so let's go for one I probably could do it's third Street Fighter 3 third strike again I'm still kind of inexperienced with the Street Fighter 3 series I think by that point I've really got thrown all my eggs in the Tekken basket at this point, but this one did bring back Chun-Li, I know for a fact, so I just want to experience it, I just want to see what it was like, I, I'm desperate to try and not just rely on Ryu characters, i.e. Fireball, Tatsu, Dragon Punch characters, because I want a bit of variety, because otherwise it's just me completing it with the same character each time. But I'm going to give it a go. If I get stuck, I'll probably end up just going with the Kuma anyway, because that's usually what tends to happen. I did not realise it had some absolutely hip-hop soundtrack, but they're called 1999. Right, well, let's go. So who's new in this version? So obviously Chanis is back here. Oh, there's Ibuki. I've got a Q, yes, because he was a character in a anime series or comic book. Remy's in this now as well. Now I don't know a lot about Remy so I'm kind of inclined to give Remy a go. Light of Justice, Supreme Rising Rage Flash, Blue Nocturne. He's got really cool names for his finish, for his uh, supers, is not he? That's not cool. But Light of Justice has caught my attention. So uh... Yeah, let's take Oro on, because Oro's a pain in the backside, so hopefully I won't get my ass royally kicked by the first guy. Even though Oro's in some weird sack. Actually, what, what is Remy like? Is Oh shit, is he a charge character? He's a bloody charge character. Oh great, I'm not, I'm not going to do very well with this. Right, okay, let's give it a go. Again, I've, I've, I've seen people play Remy quite well, so I'm inclined to just... Oh, freaking hell, he's hard to hit, isn't he, old Moro? Let's just zone him out, then, if that's the way you want to play it. And I've been... Uh, apologies, I've been playing far too much Mortal Kombat, I'm totally off the, off the beat with, with Street Fighter in general. Ow. That was a very poor round. Very, very poor round. I mean, they just take pity on you in the first round, and then later on they're just going to really beat the cat. I mean, I don't know any combos for Remy. I mean, I have on good authority. He's a very fluid character to play as. I just... I don't know what I'm doing. I'm pretty sure I twatted him there. Oh, that... Oh, yeah, I forgot about that fucking parry. Okay, Light of Justice is pretty fucking cool. You win. He's not as quick as I thought he'd be. I, I For some bizarre reason, where he looks like Freeman from... um. Uh, Mark of the Wolves. I just assumed he'd be the same. And yeah, let's 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 let's, let's have a bit of Chun Li. Chun Li is an absolute um, classic. And because I wasn't in Street Fighter Three back in the day, I wasn't there for the the uproar that she wasn't in, you know, Street Fighter Three. I mean, Chun Li is an old charge character, so again, I I don't survive particularly well with characters like that. But no, I'll tell you what, if, if, if I inevitably fail as Red, I'm going to give Chun Li a go. I do like Chun Li. Can't play it, though. Oh, right, okay, so his attack goes up below her. Uh oh. Nah, cut that shit out. Oh, crap. I'm getting 
absolutely wailed on here. That's right, the old classic now. High booster taught me that. Hit him first, then hit your super. That's what he's always told me to do. And I've got rated a C. I am, yeah, look, I, I, I agree. I'm playing incredibly poorly right now. This is not nowhere near some kind of master class, but. I don't think you have to master a game to make content on it. For me, it's, it's, it's nice seeing, like. An ordinary person playing it without having to be in the world championships. You don't have to be in the world flipping championships all the time. It's just I'm all about you know I've been real. You know, oh. Although Sean annoys the crap out of me, I, I make no secret about that. Get off! That would chipped him out, didn't it? That definitely did. Ow! Punk! Oh! I thought I caught him there. Oh, we love... We, we love a double sweep. Ow, that hurt. I'm just playing him like the one guile combo I know, which is jumping punch, standing punch, as you're charging back, release the <laughs> release the projectile. D plus. Bonus stage. Remy versus a car. I mean, there's probably other moves he's got, which probably would be more suitable. I just jumped over it. What an idiot. Come on. Batter it. This two-hit kick seems to be doing the biz, so I'm just going to persevere with that. There we go. I love that little whistle noise. That whistle noise reminds me of Bishy Bashy Special. <laughs> Oh, Necro is just fucking weird. Let's just fight him. Although he goes stretchy and weird. I must admit, the, the Street Fighter 3 characters just, for me, they just they just weren't as memorable. Not as memorable as like the ones even even in Alpha, to be honest. As you know, as we said in our uh, sort of YouTube podcast and stuff. One. Get off! Fuck! Oh dear, I'm in trouble. Oh fuck! Did I get away with that? Come on, throw the freaking! It's that moment where the computer knows you're doing the input for a projectile and will always jump. I mean, Mortal Kombat is the biggest bastard for that. Oh, I fucked it. I, I duly got punished there for being a fucking idiot. Yeah, this game's not fucking around now. Of course, he just blocks everything. No, I'm fucked. Piss off, you fucking pallid weirdo. Oh, hang on! I've got... He's, he is Guile! I don't, I don't like Guile! <laughs> I, I swear that Flash is actually hitting him. Okay, this is getting stressful. This is getting very, very stressful. Oh yeah, Necro's got a little friend, doesn't he? I forgot about that. that that's a weird storyline, if you can call it that. Yeah, this is not rated to be very highly at all. But look, look, I'm trying something different. I'm, I'm, I'm resisting the urge to go Ken Ryu Akuma. Saga. I don't think Saga's in this, but... Oh yeah, 12. Is he a, a piece of gum? I think Hayabusa called him. Okay, 
okay. He's just weird, isn't he? Look, look at the way he walks. It's not okay. It's not okay. It's like what happens. This is this is like why you shouldn't leave putty like out. Stop blocking your big twit. Oh. I'm sorry, I don't respect the characters that go invisible. It really irritates me. Because if you play as them, it's no benefit to you. You don't know where they are. How do you, how do you control something you do not see? Oh, fuck me. Just turned into a big flap then. Well, that's not a, something I particularly want to... It's the noises he makes. They're really unsettling. The fact he's basically spawn. Have some of that. I got another one. Go on, yeah. You get another one for free on me. Chipped him. <laughs> Chip damage. He is a bit of a fucking rock star, Remy, isn't he? Look at him with his with his chest out. An E plus plus. Wow, I'm actually getting worse. I am actually officially getting worse at this game. Uh, I ain't fighting Ryu. I'm gonna fight Hugo. Thank you very much. Is that poison? Hello, poison. Hugo's gonna grab me from across the screen. I can see straight away. Fuck me. I am getting absolutely pummeled here. Is that one of his standard moves? That's just, I was stunned. That fucking stun bar. I've not noticed me getting them close to a fucking stun. I mean, blocking enthusiasts. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, the parry, I, I don't like the parry mechanic in this game. Probably because I can't do it. The only reason you don't like something is because you can't actually do it. Why is he so aerial? He's a rest He's got no health. He's got no fucking health. I do like his kind of comedic faces, like a metal slug. Oh, come on, that hit. So did, look at the size of him. The guy's a giant fucking walking hip. Oh, fuck me. Look how much damage that one move did. What? Big blocking Sally. I'm doing his fucking super, you knob. Fine. Just ignore my fucking controls. Brilliant. I always do that. What happens if I select another character? Do they, in fact... Uh, that's a fireball, isn't it? No. Oh good, it doesn't take you back to the fucking beginning. Yeah, I'm, I'm avoiding why you like the fucking plague here. Let me just check Chun Li's. Uh, is she still a charge character? Because she did have some. Yeah, spinning bird kick. No. She's exactly how I left her. Oh. Fucking hell, this is not fucking around this game, is it? I forgot how wimpy her fucking. What? What the fuck ass move is that? Oh, hit me up with spinning bird kick, you punk. Oh, 
Oh, he was mi he was fucking me there when I pulled that. That Hienshu. Oh, I love that move. My get out of jail free card. Oh, fuck. Have it. Fucking have it. Yes, I. At least I got a rough idea what I'm doing with Chun Li. Rough. But I got a, a win with Chun Li, so that's kind of something. And she was new for Street Fighter Third Strike, so. Right, I've got a score to settle with Hugo now. Hugo L'Oreal here. You like parrying? Would you like... Why is this... Why is this strategy working? All I'm doing is... He's yammering the... Uh... No, not... Okay, tactics over. Play properly now. Tactics completely over now. Okay, this is a different kettle of fish, completely. Understand how he's managed to get a super gauge because he's got he got he got absolutely annihilated first round. How's he got a super gauge? Answer: Because they just give it to you because they want to take your fucking money because it's a fucking arcade game, isn't it? Have some of this, you fuck. Of course he blocked it. Of course he fucking blocked it. Chunli, please stop having such a fucking wimpy. His moves do way too much damage, but is this my in? No, he's not down! That should have finished him! That did finish him. <laughs> oh, and with a chip damage win as well. Ah, I see. E plus, fuck. I think we'll try match speed with speed. Yun is a good character though. The only reason I'm avoiding Alex is every time I've done a Street Fighter 3 video, Alex has made an absolute mess with me. But every time I play, play, play as Alex, I'm woefully inept. There's a lot of shadow boxing going on here. Fuck. Oh, how did, how did you read the Hian show? Absolutely pummeled it. Okay. One of that five will just conveniently stop right in front of his face. Oh, this is not good. He caught me perfectly there. That's not a bad combo. Chip him out, you fucker. Have that! I'm not gonna lie, this game is severely pissing me off now. Just fuck off! Big... Let's do it again! Got him finally. This is so stressful. Oh, shut up. Yay, Zurian. I haven't even come up with Gil yet. I've got old Budgie Smuggler number two here before I've hit Budgie Smuggler number one. But if you try Zurian, I'm fucking rubbish. He's so he's he is power, he's very very powerful. He's a. I realise the whole Greek Adonis is the whole thing they were going for with with him and his brother, but what well, can just 
fun in it. Beat his ass. Go. Fuck. Got him that time. Gotcha, fucker. That is impressive, though. I do love that one. That that is that's why our players are in EX Plus Alpha. Come on, bring in Cheesy McCheatington. Oh, I hate this guy. I freaking hate this guy. I'm not gonna lie. I can't stand Gil. He's not as cool as M. Bison, is he? Well, that'd be so much easier to get changed, wouldn't it, if you just did that? I don't like this guy. I don't like this guy. Okay. No guts, no glory! Chipped him out, you fucker! Eat that! Satisfying. Urian and Gil were nowhere near as difficult as um. Oh, there's an achievement for third strike. Oh, they were nowhere near as hard as Yun was the one who gave me the biggest trouble. Oh, I do like Chan Li in this game. She's good, isn't she? There was, I can't remember which versions of Street Fighter it was, of um, which I just didn't get on with Chun-Li. But this one, I like her. Look how philanthropic she is as well. Yeah, I go to Chun-Li school. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that will be Street Fighter 3 third strike if you've come this far thank you very much for choosing to spend your time with me if you like this video please drop a little like for it and perhaps subscribe to the channel if you're new so yeah that's the three street fighter 3 games done on the 30th anniversary collection I've, I've enjoyed them i've enjoyed them for someone who didn't play much of the street fighter 3s when they first come out i've really i've quite enjoyed these ones it's um it's not as my favorite as much as the alpha games but it is good. It's it looks beautiful. It it does play quite well as well. I mean, it's um, for its day. This was 1999. It it's not bad at all. Definitely worth checking out. But guys, seriously, if you could see a copy of the 30th anniversary collection somewhere, do check it out because it's a nice history lesson. It's really nice to sample where Street Fighter has come from, basically. But if you do like beat 'em ups and you certainly like the haphazard way that I play them, I do do beat 'em ups on Twitch. Tuesday nights, I have something called Bruise Days, where I do play Street Fighters, Mortal Kombat, Tekken's, SNK games, a whole host of them. But because I absolutely love me beat 'em up, so if that is your sort of thing and my ridiculous style of play is your thing, I'd love to come see you. Come drop by and say hi. But I'm gonna leave this here and say, guys, thanks again for watching. Stay safe, everyone, and I'll see you next time for more Mad Street Fighter action. Until then, take care. Bye bye.